up you guys it's Momo and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing again and I'm going to try not to break it this time okay her head is in the way is in the way is in the way is in the so if you saw my what I got for Christmas 2019 video which was the last video I uploaded I got this wonderful figure of cyan from show by rock first of all look at the packaging Okay, I know this unboxing hasn't started yet, but just like, can we appreciate this packaging, please? Oh my god. Sorry if the camera is too zoomed in, but if I were to zoom it out anymore, you'd see the tripod, and I don't know what's worse. So I'm really excited about this. Bear with me if the lighting is bad, if the focusing goes off. Bear with me about this setup because I don't have anything cute to set this on to show it off. Uh, I only have this pink towel, so uh, I'm going to try to make do with that. But yeah, so this is the packaging. <laughs> Confession, I already opened this, but I didn't like take it out of its plastic cover. I kind of just appreciated it in all its glory and beauty uh, inside the packaging. So I have the instruction kind of manual thing right here. Oh, here she is. Oh my god. Okay, so let's put the box to the side. Look at her. She's so beautiful. Oh my god. I don't know if you can like see it that great with the plastic on it, but it's like really, it's packed really nicely. I kind of like this thing where you can kind of pull on it. I also like how on the base of the figure, there's plastic wrapping as well. But yeah, all right, let's, let's get this baby open. All right, I tried to fix the angle. I don't know if that even made a difference. Either it did or it just made it like 10 times worse. Oh! Oh my gosh, okay. Oh my God, this is so exciting. She is so cute. Oh my god, she looks like a Maho Shoujo. Okay. Alright, thank god she comes out easily, so I don't have to like pull her out and risk breaking her. But that's Cyan. Oh my goodness. Alright, she has plastic on her foot, plastic around her neck. Look how beautiful she is. The thing that I was excited the most about this figure, because I've been wanting it for a while, but the thing that like really made me want it, look at the detail in the hair. Look at the coils. Oh my god, I hope that focuses. Look at that. That is amazing. That is beyond impressive. I love when they make figures like that. It is so amazing. Look at that. You can even like get a little peek over here. But the frills, oh, even on like the pantsu. <laughs> oh my gosh. She looks. She's, she's adorable. I love this figure. I think I think this is like the best figure that was made of her. I'm pretty sure. So happy that I got it. So now she comes with a guitar. If you look at the guitar, you'll see the strings, right? But the strings actually move. They're actually real strings. Not real guitar strings, but it's like, ah. And I freaking love her guitar so much. I mean, look how cute that is. That's the back. I think I think that's like a magnet. So I'm gonna try to put this on her after I take everything out. So this is her stand. I'm not like a big fan of the stand. I do like the design on it, but I just hate how they make a lot of figures with large stands. The reason I say that is because I don't really have a lot of room in my room for figures. So when there's a big stand like this, it kind of takes like unnecessary space where you could use that space for other figures. But yeah, it is a cute design. Very simplistic, but like not at the same time. I don't, I don't know how to explain that. Oh, and of course, how can I forget? I showed you the guitar. She also comes with, in here, two guitar picks in case you lose one or break one. Like I broke the Nendroid. Oh, it literally got underneath my nail. <laughs> she comes with two guitar picks. I don't know how I'm supposed to put this tiny ass thing on her. Um, but I'll try. I'm gonna move this away and then we're gonna try to 
set her up how she's supposed to be set up. Two hours later. Three hours later. Okay, wait, I don't know how I'm supposed to get the guitar on her. Seven hours later. Day two. Her head is so big. Day three. Day four. Let's use our handy dandy manual. Many months later. God, this isn't rocket science, Momo. Come on. One eternity later. Oh, I think I... What? Tomorrow for sure. Wait, I legitimately do not know what I'm doing. Hold on. Alright, let's see if there are any... There's any help that I can get from the reviews. No reviews. Eventually. Oh my goodness. We finally got it. Oh my goodness. Okay. That was literally more difficult than it should have been. These instructions look like they're telling you that you have to give her the her right arm which is this one the strap first so i'm putting it underneath her freaking arm and feeding it over her head because that's what it's pretty much telling you right no you're just you're not supposed to put it under here you're supposed to put it on top <laughs> maybe that's common sense but i did not know that so now we can put it under here all right so that's that jesus christ that took longer than it should have and now we have the guitar pick that I got in as well. The guitar pick was easy. You're putting it in between her index finger and her thumb. And it kind of just sticks right in there. It sits in there pretty nicely, but I'm kind of scared that it's going to come off. I guess that's why they give you two of them just in case, but they're so tiny. So you gotta be really careful. And I'm not careful, so. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much her in all her glory. Um, I know this kind of, is a sucky angle and a sucky way to kind of unbox but just stay tuned till the end and, and i'll give you like a closer and much better look uh so yeah that's cyan i am so thankful that i finally got another figure she's not a maho shoujo but she's an idol and i love idols in anime and um she looks like a maho shoujo ah i don't know i just really love her and i love her tail so much we love a good Neko tail. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry this wasn't the best video, but at least I didn't break it this time. Please make sure you subscribe if you enjoyed this video and check out my other videos. All my social media is going to be in the description. If you have not followed me yet there, please do so. And please check out my Etsy shop also in the description. Um, I'm coming out with new items very, very soon. So thank you guys so much, and I will see you in the next one. Bye! While I was unboxing this, I kind of forgot to mention, I absolutely do love the hair coils, yes. And I also, oh, first of all, the bell. The bell is adorable. But I also love this kind of like gradient, this kind of detailed paint style on her dress and the folds that you can see I don't know oh my god like on her sleeve as well I'm just like really confused about one thing is she supposed to be dressed like a maid cuz I'm not sure I don't know if it was mentioned in the actual anime but I, she, I know she's got this kind of headband going on and that's like usually like I guess what maids would wear like if you look at Mayrin from um, Black Butler or you look at Toru from uh, Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid, they kind of have the whole thing going on in their maids. Um, there's also this frill thing going on. This is like really beautiful. Even you can even see the color of the guitar. Kind of gradients in the middle from a dark pink to kind of like a lighter pink. Also, if you know, I initially thought that this was a magnet at the bottom, but it doesn't seem to be, I don't think. So if you know what that is, or what it's for, or if it's just there, let me know. Leave a comment because I'm kind of confused. Also, let's appreciate her eyes. All right, guys, that's about it for me. I'll see you next time.